I think that uh, we have amazing energy, whether we're built on ley lines, as some people will say, um, whether there's some other, you know, whether there's aliens in Lake Pontchartrain, I don't know what the answer is. We definitely have a much more vibrant energy than most other places in the world. The river surrounds us, it's our world. We walk outside, we can hear the calliope, we hear the cruise ships, it's always present there. That is where I see a tremendous amount of activity for the future of New Orleans. And so I just see it growing immensely. I, I can barely describe the activity that I see on that river. I see a lot of development, not just you know apartments, condos, and things like that, but I see a lot of business development. I see hotels going all the way from Julia down to Poland. People are afraid of us losing our culture as a result of that. Well, musicians have to have gigs, right? Musicians have gigs at hotels. Musicians have gigs at clubs. So, you know, the, it's going to actually help people. I see a tremendous amount of expansion in suburban areas, which is weird. Um, I think the more people are moving into the city from other places, the more the prices are going to go up, the more things like that. I think that we're going to have to figure a way to enable people to live, perhaps who can't afford the city prices, in the suburbs in ways that make it more convenient. So transportation is going to change. We're very valuable. Um, because of our location and because of our port. So we have to protect that. And I think that um, there is, again, with this influx of younger people who are thinking more in terms of that, I feel that it's being taken very seriously. It is an area where we are putting a lot of time and energy, and so I feel that we are rebuilding that to the best of our ability. You know, but I, I don't see us underwater anytime soon. Thank you.